I just I feel like to base struggles for women solely to a parent is kind of disrespectful. Like I feel that's like, not, yeah, that's not well, but that's do. kind of all you've been mentioning is appearance and a wage gap that doesn't exist. When I would say like the biggest struggle women face is people saying that you can just become a woman. That's in my opinion, mm. the biggest struggle women face is you can just put on some tits and makeup and be one of us. Yes. But I, yeah. yeah, I don't believe in that. And I think that's the biggest struggle we face. I agree. Okay. I mean, I respect that. <laughs> People putting on a costume and trying to be us. Claire, do you have anything on that? <clears throat> I mean, obviously, I, I don't agree with it. I, I don't know what else to say to I mean that's just what you think or, and I don't think that same way but yeah multiple people don't agree with yeah. that but I mean it's just like a matter of fact it doesn't matter what you put or wear on your body if you're a biological male you'll never be a female or a woman so I mean you can dress up like one like you can dress up like a mime but it's the same thing it's a costume <laughs> okay but a, a mime dresses up for a performance that's also the same thing in my you opinion. You think it's a performance? Yeah. I you think don't it think is. it's genuinely how they feel in their core? Um, I think I think most of the time. Which way? This no. way? No, no. To that way. Scoot it closer towards you. No, no, no. Not you. Sorry. It's just the <laughs> microphone was, her, her face was blocked. Go ahead. Go ahead. Oh, I think you were in the middle of talking. Or was oh, I? yeah. Um, yeah, I do absolutely think it's a performance. And I think that. Most of these times, these people are assigned an affirming therapist. They're not actually looking into anything deeper into their, into their life. They're just saying, oh, okay, you, you think you're a woman? All right, here's some hormones. Here's some sexual reassignment surgery. Here's a way to make me and my company some I'm money. I'm pretty sure they have to do a psychological evaluation before Yeah, no, not forward. really. I've, there's so many. You should really look into She's stories correct. of people talking to private journalists, people who have transitioned come back years later that sue their parents and their doctors for letting okay, them Okay, so you're talking about children. Let's talk about adults. Oh, Cause yeah. Because that's a completely different subject. But the entire world isn't on that page with you where they like to lump them into each other. So the rest of the country doesn't believe that there's a distinction between that. They think that children oh, have because, every so right just like adults. So because half the country doesn't think that way just means I shouldn't think that way? No, I. this is my opinion. We're talking about my opinion, right? So yeah, my opinion is that you cannot wear a costume and become a... Uh, somebody else's jet I don't think no matter how many breasts a man puts on no matter how many hormones he takes no matter how many dresses he wears he's never going to be a woman he'll never have my experience as a woman and he'll never be able to have children or procreate or be a mother like a woman so it is. offends you when someone identifies yeah, as a woman. It does. and why yeah. does it offend you it offends me because you're trying to be me and you're not me they're not trying to be you I they don't want to be you. To be women. Yeah. They no. Wait. Well, so so, so why question? does it so why does it offend you? Because they're trying to be. They're not it, trying to be you. It, it actually, offends me because the country yeah. can't distinct with the fact that like you can be a cow. That's fine. Do whatever you want. I but you're not gonna. I'm not done not talking. Cow. So you can be a cow. Do whatever you want. But I don't think it's right to let biological men live in sororities with other females i don't think it's right to let them into bathrooms with other females i don't think it's right to let them play sports with females and win against them i think that's wrong okay. so when nobody else likes to distinctualize that with just being a woman yeah there's there's a bigger conversation that needs to be had okay sure i mean i, I think agree with emily Okay, I, I think there's that. a I think Me there's a, a very important mm -hmm. distinct Okay, I should we wrap am I are we going over time or It's okay. We'll we'll talk about it for a bit then I'll wrap up. Okay. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, I don't want to take up all your yeah, time. Yeah, that's good. Go ahead. Go um, ahead. I have one last question afterwards and then we're done. We're okay, done. Know, okay. Guys, we're gonna, we'll get Stop. out of here soon. This shit's getting deep. Yeah, yeah. I was just going to say I think there's an important <clears throat> distinction and I was watching a video on this the other day and I agree with important distinction between people who are doing it because it's a trend and then people who are genuinely trans and I think people who are doing it as a trend ruin the the representation of actual trans people and the image of actual trans people who feel like I'm not comfortable in my body. I don't think this is the body I was supposed to be born in. Right. You know? Right. That's that's but I believe that's a mental illness and I believe that needs to be looked at yes. a lot deeper and not just reaffirmed into okay, yeah, take this surgery, take these hormones mm -hmm. and potentially ruin your life. So, I think we're yeah. doing those people with gender dysphoria a huge disservice because yeah. it is a very serious mm -hmm. surgery and I find it personally offensive because they talk about like like oh if you're transgender you can get this like like big surgery and when I like as a woman for 
for like uh, endometriosis, which is like a, a women's issue. Um, I needed uh, surgery, which is a minimally invasive surgery. Yes. They wouldn't give it to me in the United States. I had to go out of the country. And then even when it comes to abortion, they say, oh, it's a women's right, women's health care, whatever. No, they don't care about women's health and they don't care about women's right because they didn't give, or they don't care about women's choice because they didn't give me the choice to get the treatment that is the closest thing that we have to a cure. They said, no, here, go on birth control pills. And I said, absolutely not. I'm not going to take birth control pills for the rest of my life. And uh, yeah. Wait, what does that have to do with trans people? Um, it's all related. It's all related. They talk about like, um, Movie. like I just find it very offensive because uh, like I don't know why you one, care about one, trans people. Trans people, trans so people much, can get surgery so easily. <clears throat> I couldn't get surgery, and then also just abortion is like a side note. It's all related. Like they say they care about women, but they don't. Okay. Uh, here, here's a question. I'm gonna try to fuse that into the dating thing. Mm. Do you think it's uh, do, you, do you think it's wrong for a man to not want to date a trans woman? Do I think it's here? Um, when it okay, mm, I don't think it's necessarily wrong, especially when it comes to like the sexual aspect, because you, there might be a guy that's like, okay, let me try this relationship with a trans woman who may still have you know male bi biological nice. body parts. For some people, they might might just not be able to get over that hump, which is like I feel like is understandable. Um, so yeah, I think, again, it uh, all comes to preference and standard. What, what about if they got the surgery to, to mm. change, but I still couldn't get over that part? Mm. So they had a, I don't know. What are Gender they, what's reassignment the, what's the surgery. Well, what's the term? I don't know. Um, Bottom surgery? Yeah. Um, yeah. Would that, would that also be, would you object to that? Like, oh, I don't want to be with someone who has the, inver what's it called, the inverted, I don't know what it's Gender called. Gender reassignment surgery? No, there's a term there's for the, term. Like oh, okay. the medical term. Bottom, Bottom surgery, I don't know the medical term. Whatever, the surgery, surgery, right? Would you object to that? Do I object to that? Yeah, fine. I, I mean, I mean pro yeah, I probably would object to that. I mean, because that person's like a woman and you say you're attracted to women, so. <sighs> had to <Yeah>. get <laughs> no, they're not a woman. Like In your opinion. Um, wait, let, is it real? Yeah, it's really good. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. Um, so, what were the four things that you said? One of them was children, right? Whoa, children whoa, whoa, that's reason. totally, un hold on, that's no, not related. Like, that's not trans, related to what you just said. No, it is. For, like, if you, if, because ch children is one of the important things in a relationship. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. And if you meet someone, and if you really want kids, like, if yeah, you want okay. your own biological kids mm -hmm. from your partner. Yeah, then that's you fine. You can't yeah. have that. So, like, to say, like, oh, even if you've, like if you've transitioned but you still won't date me that's not fair i mean if someone really wants biological children it is fair okay then that's a standard they say i want a partner who can have biological children with well, me yeah but like <laughs> the only person say, who doesn't fit that is going to be someone who's trans your definition of woman is extremely different my definition of a woman is someone with a uterus who can have children Quirk. And I mean, some women can have children, and that's very sad, but they're still a woman because of every hormone in their brain, body, and every bone in their body is female. It has to do with so. chromosomes. I, I have a, since I want to come back to the whole dating, mm -hmm. like trying to focus it on dating. What is a woman? And I want to start with you. We'll go around the table. <laughs> Great. Um, a woman is someone who... I like identifies as a woman. I don't really know. We'll let everybody finish. Go ahead. It's kind of like I'm not really like one side or the other side. It's like I'm not against trans people. Never uh, that, will be. Like that's I'm just, just not. For... I would say a woman is somebody who is capable to have children, but at the same time, people can also identify as a woman. I don't. I don't have a problem with that. Sure, you do you, but I truly know that I am a woman. I can have children. I get a period every month. Like, I yeah. Well, I mean, I would also I would just point out that there are there are women who are infertile, for example. Mm -hmm. They're still women <clears throat> even though they can't have children. But go ahead. Uh, I def I want to clarify this because I don't want to I don't want it to seem like oh I'm a woman today but a man tomorrow. I'm, that's to me like I said there's an important distinction and to me that's someone who's following it for the trend. To me a woman is someone who identifies with it and like that is and identifies I don't with what ad said. identifies as being a woman but not just like any day of the week that they feel like like they're it's part of their identity. Okay. Yeah. 
an essential part. Identifies but as so, what? so what is a woman? Yeah. 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 So what is a woman? <laughs> Well, you accepted her woman. answer. Why is my answer not acceptable? So your, 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 your answer, your answer is just is make sure I'm making sure I'm understand. A woman is a woman who identifies as a woman with some degree of continuity. So it's not just okay. To, exactly. Monday I'm a man. Tuesday. Yeah. Okay. So there needs to be some continuity. It needs to be part of your identity. Like you genuinely feel like I okay. do not feel like I was supposed to be born in this body. So a woman. Yeah. A woman is a is someone who identifies as a woman essentially. Essentially. Okay. What about you? I think for a woman, it is someone. I I don't even want to say. I want to say. Can I? I don't want to say can have children because there are women who can't have children. I still do identify those as women. I identify trans people as a trans woman because you have a, an entire different past than a woman who was born that way. And I think that's a big distinction people I need agree to with make. that part yeah. for sure, yeah. yeah. Because I think it's, it's, it's I, I do get upset sometimes when someone says, I'm a woman, and it's because our experiences are different. I, I recognize a woman, if someone says, I am a trans woman and this is how I identify, I respect the hell out of that and the choices that they made, whether or not they make the surgery or not. Mm -hmm. But they have a completely different upbringing than, than mine. Oh, I would agree so with that, yeah. It's, it's sort of like when people say, I don't see color. That's kind of the problem. It's because you're not recognizing someone's background mm -hmm. and what they had to do to, for where they're at. They have a completely different experience. I recognize I mean, that for sure. I mean, not to derail the conversation, but like, wasn't that whole Martin Luther King's whole thing to be colorblind? Colorblind in a sense, but okay, let's not go. Yeah, down. Yeah, that's <laughs> just another, that's a whole other can of worms. What about? What is a woman? Um, a woman, I don't think I really need to answer this. It's somebody who was born as a female and is a female today. It's pretty simple. A woman is a human person with two X chromosomes. Amy? A woman is someone with female chromosomes. You said XX, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. I was kind of confused with which one was X, X and XY. Sure. But um, someone who is able to produce uh, kids, someone who has, gets a period every single month with a vagina. Well, some women don't have Yeah, periods, yeah some women don't even have periods. Uh, Lynn, what about you? Um, a woman is someone with XX chromosomes. OK. Uh, Q? Uh, a woman is an adult human female. That's also my definition. Oh, a woman okay. is an adult human female. Okay. What, you're, you're smiling, you're yeah. laughing at that. I think I, I <laughs> I'm, just saying, I'm just saying thumbs up, that's all. Yeah, I think I would agree with, with, yeah, I agree with, with her, her on the trans woman topic. I would consider them trans women, not women, because yeah. there is a difference. A woman is a adult human female, and now that everybody wants to say gender is a construct, they want to deconstructualize the entire society that we've lived in since we were the conception of humans literally we have always gone by male female genders and now that everybody wants to diminish that and just oh what's a woman what's a what's a kid what's a, like mm -hmm. that doesn't make it we know what a woman is a woman is an adult human you know female. you think you know what it is yeah i know what it is and i know that the, a lot of other people are confused okay. yes okay okay so bringing it back to the dating thing you said that you would object to somebody if they've undergone bottom surgery a guy not wanting to date a trans woman who has undergone bottom surgery, you would object to that? Yes. Can you articulate your reasoning and logic? I'm, I, I mean, what's the question? Like, but it's, well, it's especially interesting because you said you're, you know, you're a virgin, you're saving yourself for the mm -hmm. person you feel like you're gonna marry. Mm -hmm. So let's say somebody like, you want to pursue someone long term for a long term relationship and have biological children with that person if you're a trans woman you are incapable of and that's why i was making that distinction earlier and like you said some not all women are fertile not all women can but have so babies why, but so i what, think what why do you object to a man not wanting to have a relationship or have sex with a trans woman well what what why wouldn't they? Well, I, f I think first they would have to present their argument. Like, why wouldn't they want to date a... What's the reason for not wanting to date a trans woman? People are allowed to have genitalia preference. But you said if they have bottom, bottom That's surgery. not the same as a... I don't know what the fucking term for it. That's not the same as, like, a... 
natural grown Organic. pussy. I don't yeah. know how to frame this, but yeah, you're yeah. Going it's about just hard to form a rebuttal when there's not like an initial. That's because you argument. think everybody works on this. As as somebody who has had sex at least one time, <laughs> <laughs> once. If once. my penis was inverted, I don't know the fucking procedure. I don't know. Um, first off, my understanding is that when they go, they do the procedure. They have to take like lifetime antibiotics so because it's, it's you're essentially creating a, a wound mm -hmm. into your cavity your pelvic cavity or something and uh it doesn't naturally lubricate and the composition would be different and i would just know that, like it ain't like am i gonna get canceled for this that's not pussy <laughs> <laughs> I'm probably gonna get canceled. For that yeah, shit. you probably will. Get All canceled. over TikTok tomorrow. <laughs> no, but it's not like it's not. It's not the same at all. It's, it's just not the same. Right. I'm not trying to hate on anybody. It's just like people have. Preferences. I have a genitalia preference for. I mean, we talked about the large labia shit, but that's another conversation. <laughs> I have a genitalia preference for. For female pussy. I'm not. I don't want male pussy. I want female pussy. <laughs> I mean, if, when you put it that way, I feel like it's okay to have a preference. I don't know. Uh -oh. I just, I just think that like there's ways around. Like you said, it doesn't lubricate naturally. Okay, there's lube. Like I don't know. I think there's what ways if I, around what it. What if I want natural juice? Pussy juice. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> I want. I don't want to use okay, KY then. jelly. I want. I want a chick that's just. It's like a river. Like sun. the floodgates are opening. I mean, I guess yeah. I See, think a, having weird. a genitalia preference. I have a genitalia. That's fine. I yeah. have had preferences preference. all day, and now that it's he wants to have a preference about someone's genitalia, it's an issue. But I we've just, been talking I just about said it's okay. Yeah, but it took him <laughs> literally. No, but it took him explaining to you that he wanted natural lube in a female vagina <laughs> to, for you to understand it. Like you see what I mean? Like it, he had to break it's, down. Well, we're talking really about. Hard. Uh, so what is that supposed to mean? That not everybody has this blind view of gender like you do. That we, a blind? I think you have the blind view. No, we. He had to, to just. <laughs> he had to just de like explain in very detail the difference between a man-made and natural vagina. No, sure? I I, to I completely understood the difference. I said what was okay. what would be his objection to dating someone trans, and that's what he explained to me. And I said it's difficult to form a rebuttal when there's no I, initial I'm, argument. I'm so. also just attracted to females. <laughs> I'm not attracted Can I to add something? I'm not attracted to males. I'm Pretty not simple. attracted I'm not attracted to males regardless of the the drugs that they're ingesting and the plastic surgery that they've had and the See that's the other thing. You're like I'm not into plastic surgery. There you go. Like But I'm just not I'm not attracted to males. But it's okay. Can I add no, no, something? No, we're talking please? about sex. We're not talking about gender. We're talking about sex. I'm not a no, no, no. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Um, okay, I understand. Like, this is a topic of conversation, and like, sure. this is a podcast. Yeah. But like, why does it matter so much? Like, why can't we just like let people do what they want to do? That's like, it's fine. not like that's totally fine. It's not. Yeah. It's very but, like, so it's. But but if we're having a conversation, yeah. if she's saying you're a bigot for not wanting. I, what? But yeah, that's putting words no, in no, my no. mouth. That, but, is, no, that is some people's matter. position. And like, you said earlier, you you object, you object to men who wouldn't want to sleep with a trans woman who's had uh, mm -hmm. bottom surgery. Yeah, but yeah. then after you explained your genitalia my, my preference, my then I said that's position, fine. Right? Yeah. Yeah, but he had to explain it for I you to, to approve. You, but you objected Usually to it. Usually people have to explain things to in order for other people I don't, to but understand. But how not, not are really. we in a crazy world where I need, as a man, a straight man need to explain that I am only sexually attracted to, to females. I think Seriously, like, I don't think it like matters to a lot of us. We really don't care. I think it's yeah. more of like please just admit that you are a bio biological male or female and just Why should I why should people admit it? I don't know. I just Because it's a like, fact. It's do a you, fact. Do you it doesn't matter. Like, how does doesn't, it change your mind? It doesn't matter on surface level, but like, when it gets into yeah. legislation and biological men being allowed into female prisons where now these female in inmates are getting R-worded, that's when it's wrong. Yeah. So, yeah, it does matter. Female it's prison, fine until it comes to a certain standard. But, that's standard. Not really, like, yeah, but, well, but do, you, do you object to a guy not wanting to sleep with a trans woman? No. Like, oh. I... 
actually i'm not going to say anything you but wouldn't, you wouldn't what i didn't say wouldn't i didn't say it's would. Okay. you um, you wouldn't I'm sleep with saying, a trans man i understand why it's okay that's fine. i understand you can have your preference. men or women don't want to sleep with transgender people that's just their preference but yeah 